Have you heard of the army that came out of a war stronger in number than it originally went in with? Here is the story of an army that went to war 80 members strong and came back from war 81 members strong. Let's find out. And set the good times rolling. Liechtenstein is a 25 km long German speaking country between Austria and Switzerland. In the year 1866, Austro Prussian War erupted. The war was between Austria on one side and the combined forces of Prussia and Italy on the other. In this map, you will see Austria in brown and Prussia and its ally Italy denoted in blue. All countries in the map shown in white remained neutral during the war, including the country Switzerland denoted here with a red cross. In between Austria shown in brown and Switzerland shown with a red cross, one can see a little green circle. Within that green circle is a tiny piece of land denoted in red. That piece of land marked in red is Liechtenstein. However, the war broke out much farther to the north. Towards the top of the map, one can see a pink circle on a piece of land denoted in green color. The pink circle denotes Holstein. Holstein is a Danish territory then controlled by Austria. Trouble began with Prussia occupying Holstein. As Prussia attacked Holstein in the north, Prussia's ally Italy attacked Austria in the south. As Austria faced a two-pronged attack, the people of Liechtenstein wished to stay neutral just like Switzerland. The elite of Liechtenstein, however, had very close diplomatic ties with Austria. So staying neutral was not an option for Liechtenstein. They had to be seen engaging in some military action favoring Austria. Liechtenstein volunteered to defend the Brenner Pass from an Italian incursion. This was a balancing act that Liechtenstein performed. While on the one hand, they were helpful to Austria militarily, on the other hand, much to the delight of their own people, they were not part of any military aggression. And so Liechtenstein sent 80 men to guard Brenner Pass, shown here in a red rhombus between Italy shown in blue and Austria shown in brown. Austria had sent a very strong force to Italy, so there was no Italian incursion at the Brenner Pass. In effect, Liechtenstein's men had nothing much to do at the Brenner Pass. Smoking their pipes and drinking wine is all that these 80 men of Liechtenstein did at the Brenner Pass. As Liechtenstein's men whiled away their time, the war came to an end with Austria facing defeat at the hands of Prussia. With the war ending in Austria's loss, there was nothing much left to do for Liechtenstein's men at the Brenner Pass. The 80 men were sent back to Liechtenstein unharmed. Apart from these 80 men, there was an additional man who accompanied them. But who was this extra man? Well, some sources suggest that it was an Austrian liaison officer. Others say it was an Italian friend, maybe a defector from the Italian army. Regardless of the identity of this man, records confirm that there indeed was an extra person who went back with Liechtenstein's army, making them 81 strong on their way back home. Here is a brief message from the creators. If you enjoy our videos or like the content we are putting out, then show us your support with three extremely simple steps. One. Make sure you press the subscribe button and the notification button. 2. Share our exceptional videos on WhatsApp, Facebook and other social media platforms. 3. 
Be generous with the like button and put in some good words for us in the comment section. Thank you for your patience. Let's get you back to your video. After this short and pleasant military exercise, Liechtenstein disbanded their army and do not have an army to this date. Unfortunately, not all wars end so well for those involved. This was the story of how 80 men went to war and 81 came back. We hope you enjoyed this story and we'd like to leave you with this quote by H.G. Wells. If we don't end war, war will end us. Please subscribe for more such videos and share this video with all your friends and let them find out.